got a video message. I'm gonna have to science the shit out of this. Hit the button, baby. Stay cool. This is a Thor News presentation. Thor News presents... February 7th. It's a thing. And apparently, the universe is an explosion within an explosion within an explosion that is exploding while creating and sustaining life. We're looking at Earth next to the sun via satellite. Asterisk. What does the asterisk stand for? I'd love to tell you, but I don't have time. So right now I'm like, Venus. Oh, Venus, put those arms around me and love me again. My, my, my. Venus is a crazy magical angel. Look at those hugging arms. And at the end, she looks like a cute chicken. So yeah, outer space is one big romance. True that, homies. Uh, everything in the solar system is putting on a show. Everything in the solar system is putting on a show. And what a show we're looking at right now. The sun is the sun is having a constant flow of very varied content. I don't think it's content. I don't know what the heck it is. So what we got here is the sun, which is our home star, and planet Earth. And that fast mover, I'm guessing, is Mercury. Mercurial Mercury. Hold up, what's that? That was the 30th. Hey, planet. That looks like a Loch Ness Monster head. Or was that just a boomerang? It's good to see the interstellar medium is patriotic. It's like a giant ocean of crazy happy creatures. Yeah, so the sun and Earth just kind of flying around the galaxy. And our solar system is Earth's hometown. Right now it extends out to Sedna. Asterisk. Asterisk. Hold off on that. There's tons of debate and then you got to find all the words and stuff. And it gets difficult at times. So let's not bite off. Well, then we could you. Unless that's what you do. You do you. Okay. And we're seeing a lot of anomalies. Oh my god, look at the ring between Venus and Earth. That's amazing. They're a pretty cute couple. I know that makes Mars mad, but I think we did just found one of the main reasons Mars has such a rivalry with Earth. It's like I called it at the beginning of the show. Romance. Oh, sun faces lined up in a row. It's like they're taking a family portrait. It's one proud family. That is one good looking family. And we have magnetic sunspots. I don't know nothing. Wait, I just learned something. But you're gonna have to be patient, because I just forgot what it is. Okay, now the sun's really kinda acting weird here. Its squishy parts are all up moving, and jiving, and jumping, and flowing. Is there mud on the sun? Oh my god. At some point, Charlie Brown went stellar. Holy crap, there's a lot of shit flying around in space. Think I see a pair of tennis shoes? I see a spatula. I see a carbon pan. I don't even know what that is. Now we're back to the yellow, normal version of the sun, asterisk, asterisk. Solar physics is crazy. Did you see the sun shoot that stuff out? That's wild. Just look at it, man. Drive you crazy. That's when they're like, stay the hell away from solar physics. You can get with this, or you can get with that. Who's the black sheep? We have our Hitchcockian V appearance. Man, there's a rave going on the sun. And then you got two sunspots jump rope in. But that snake sliding across the sun's face. And that's pretty crazy looking. Totally. Now we're staring right in the dragon's face. No, it's a woman. Wait, it's both. What? Yeah. Uh-oh. There are theories that people from other dimensions are reaching into our dimension and stealing our stuff. I'm not saying it's true, but that one thing I just saw made me think, okay, yeah, maybe. Man, Venus and Earth are just cruising. And she must like Earth a lot. I do not know if you have seen her in the sky lately. But she's been oh so bright and beautiful. Holy crap. Look at those colors. Those are auroras. Auroras are like the sun's text messages to Earth. And also, Mars probably mad all the time because Earth and Venus get most of the face time. Now we're looking at the sun's epidermis. And it's doing wild things. I'm thinking caterpillar, cocoon, butterfly. Phoenix, maybe. No, no, the only time will tell. And I feel that I should tell you, science does not totally agree with that theory. Oh, now we're racking it up. Solar rain. Solar rain. Oh, and now it's a lady's eye. Eye shadow on the sun. 
said she's laugh because she was like, that is my eye. I was like, I know. Jedi dating is weird. Okay. We're looking at the sun. Still. Because the sun hangs out with us. Day and night. You may not be able to see him or her at night. But oh. The sun is there. And the giant blocky pulses of light. Give way to earth as an eye. And when the left made fun of the right eye today. I was like, guys and girls. What did I do to get in trouble again? Remember, I was always in trouble. Wow. That definitely looks like a dragon skin. Absolutely. With a little bit of solar fuzz. It's like the sun's building a porch. There was some snap, crackle, popping going off. I saw I point that out. That looks like George Washington's wearing a crown. That's pretty. Is the sun. Well, I hear a train a coming. It's coming around the bend. And I ain't seen balance since I don't know when I got shot and resurrected in Reno. And I found my way back home. Well, I walked 40 damn miles to barbed wire. Rattlesnake is a necktie. Me, coffins and wine. What? Nah, it looks like a zombie. So that means it will probably be popular with the kids in the 23 to 32 demographic. Oh, wow. That looks like... I'm seeing eyeballs. That's definitely an eyeball that has more eyeballs growing out of it, but not in a creepy way. A bit in, a bit in color. You should have some amazing eyeshadow. Hey. Hey, dudes. You guys are cool. It looks fun in the sun. Like one big party after another. Boom, 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 ba -doom. That is crazy. Whoa. We're still looking at the sun. And it's still freaking out. I know I'm crazy. I'm crazy good. But I still got an honest feeling. Everything is going to be alright. A-OK. -okay. Magic. Super duper. Awesome. Fantastic. Like a movie with an amazing ending. Only, I know, through solar physics and the strokes. Plus God, the end has no end. And that sunspot looks like a car on fire that turns into a dog. And that. It's a good sign. Party people.